Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Today, inshallah, we will learn the correct method for evaluation for the element number 5 from domain B, single use devices. Single use devices, it is element 5 from domain B and it's contain or including one sub element. For the activity for the auditing, we need for documentation and staff interview and observation also. For the scoring, it's have only 0 or 2. Sub element B5.1 The facility has an implemented policy for no reuse of single use item based on the national regulation. For this sub element, we need for documentation, observation, and staff interview to we can evaluate and audit this sub element. First, we need to know what is the single use device or the definition of the single use device. It is a medical device that it is intended for single use only on a single patient for single procedure and then should be discarded and also it should be no or not uh, be reprocessed or used again for the same uh, patient that means it is uh, made for single patient single procedure and after that it should be discarded immediately How we know that this device it is single use or no? All the single use device it should be packed and marked as single use. There is written single use, or they have a, a international sign for a single use items. This is the sign for the single use items. It is like number two with a slash over the number.
you need to review the policy and procedure for the uh, single use device and this policy should be clearly defined and state the single use device and also it should be including the definition of the single use device as we uh, mentioned uh, before and also how we know this is single use device or no it should be uh, uh, mentioned that this device are packaged and marketed as single use device or they have the international sign for the single use items and also the classification of this item based on associated risk like this is a critical semi-critical and non-critical items Also, the policy it should be including that the single-use devices should not be reprocessed or used again, even for the same patient. And also, it should be mentioned that the disposable single-use device that have been opened and not used should be not be reprocessed or re-sterilization. And also, it should be mentioned for the uh, discarded or for the how we will be uh, discard this uh, uh, single-use device that the single-use device it should be discarded by the end user at the point of use as per hospital protocols. Also, you need to check that this uh, policy it is fully applicable and it can be applied and comply with the hospital scope service. And this policy based on the scientific reference approved by the Ministry of Health. And also, you can check the memo from the GDIPC regarding regulation for the single use devices, stating that there is no reuse for the single use device. Also, it should be a sign from authorized person like medical director or hospital director and this policy should be approved by the infection control committee and also it should be valid and updated within two to three years and when indicated. You need also to ask and review the OVR occurrence variance report. 
uh, to check if there is any single use items that sent already to the CSSD for reprocessing. You can ask the infection control about any OVR that mentioned there is any reprocessing for the single use item and they sent already to the CSSD for reprocessing. For the observation, you need to observe the use of single use device by the staff in different patient care area to notice any breaches in the practice. As example, you can or maybe you will find used gown hanging at the back side of the door in the dental lab. And this means that they are reused the single uh, use device, what we know it as the uh, uh, yellow gown or single yellow gown. And also, maybe you will find single use tourniquet used for multiple patients in the flippotomy room. And also, the face shield. The reuse of the face shield is also a common practice. Maybe you will find any face shield that they are reused, and this is it is the uh, single use device. For the interview, you need to do interview with the staff to ensure effective implementation of the single-use policy. You can randomly ask the staff about the protocol of handling single-use device, and you need to use indirect question or scenario to ask or to do the interview with the staff. You can use uh, indirect question like how you will disinfect this single-use item to be reused safely. And also you can uh, give them a scenario and you can take any example of the uh, single use device like airway circuits, like in catheter, intravenous seat or personal protective equipment like gown and ask them, can you demonstrate the procedure that should be applied on this device before reuse? And you will wait for them answer and them answer, it should be correct answer. Like we never reuse single use device because it can be used only one time. 